And to on those states, former Inspector General of Police Sunday Hinderu says what Nigeria needs at this critical time is community policing rather than hiring of mercenaries to end the war against insurgency, as suggested by the governor of Boronu State. Mr. Hinderu stated this at a stakeholder summit on community policing in Akure, the Ondo State capital. Ayodeji Moradeo tells us more. The rising security in Nigeria propelled the federal government to launch community policing initiative in September. Weeks after the launch of the initiative, the first set of personnel, numbering about 288, have graduated. At these stakeholders meeting in Nakura, the need for traditional rulers to give support to community policing took center stage. Some traditional rulers present here believe that the Amatekun Corps must work together with other security agencies to ensure safety of lives and property of citizens. The monarchs who lamented the killing of one of their own, the Olufa of Ifo, urged police authorities to fish out his killers. The, the essence of it all is that uh, the, the level, the, I mean, the system of gov governance, which we all agree is federalism, we should go into it deeply. Third time we are embarrassed by, by killing one of our important monarchs, Israel, and those. And I want to leave, let me tell you one simple today. We have to sell some of our private security to all the other before they can come here today. Former Inspector General of Police, Sunday Indira, believes that hiring machineries to tackle insurgency in the Northeast is not the way out of the current security threat. He says efforts must be made to adequately fund community policing in the country. In, in, in their desperation, the governor of, uh, of Bornu, uh, Professor Zulu, said they should invite mercenaries to come and do it for us. Some people say retired police, uh, military officer. Some people say let them get hunters. But those are desperation. What you need is community police. The community nominated the constables. And virtually in every community, every village, every hamlet, somebody has been nominated. Of course, one person policing 400 people. It's not that he's going to know everything about the 400 or know everything about the household. State Commissioner of Police said the command will ensure that those who killed the former monarch are brought to justice. Over 288 special constables were carefully recruited from different communities in Ondo State. Ayodeji Moradeo, TVC News, Akure.